Hello there. Today I want to show you how to reduce the magnetic interference that you sometimes get with um, the Sony Alpha 5100 cameras. Um, it is not always a problem, it depends on where the camera gets installed compared to your magnetometer in the airplane. Um, but if you have your camera close by your autopilot, where the mag magnetometer is situated, um, so if you have it close to your um, the, the compass GPS unit on the Pixhawk, um, that is where you can potentially have a problem or where the, the Pixhawk unit itself is situated very close to the camera. So um, the problem is caused by a magnet that is um, in the, the display panel of the camera. So you know, take a piece of metal like this and you place it on the display panel at the back of it, um, you can locate the position of the magnet. So the magnet of course is, is used to keep the the display panel nicely um, attached to the back of the camera um, when it is not deployed. Um, but there is actually a, a little bit of a, a, a sort of a, a friction locking mechanism as well. So if you take the magnet out, um, it can still, you know, be placed in the in the um, sort of recessed position, and it will stay there. So it's not a big issue if you remove the magnet, um, but it does reduce the magnetic interference that you get with your autopilot. So, so again, just to show you, um, there is a little bit of a sort of a bump um, in the metal back plate of the display, and right there is where the magnet is situated. So taking the magnet out is actually a very simple procedure. Um, you just need to have uh, some some fine screwdrivers, um, a Phillips head, a fine Phillips head screwdriver to take the screws out, and then um, I, I use a small flat head screw, screwdriver as well, um, basically just to pry open the, the back of that panel. So first step is to take the screws out. Um, now there are four screws to take out, uh, two right on the back of the panel, and then two more on the edge of the panel. These are tiny little screws, so be careful when you take them out um, that you don't lose them. Okay, so now the screws are out, and the next step is to, to just pry the back plate off. Um, it's, it's not attached very strongly, but it helps to, to kind of use a, you know, something like a small flathead screwdriver. Um, there is a little bit of a, an indentation on the side there that, that is probably made for this purpose. So you just sort of wedge it in there, and then pry the back plate loose and carefully pull it apart just like that so at this stage you can actually see the magnet so the magnet sits right there and the magnet is not glued in um, it, it's just in there by a little bit of friction so you can just pry it out quite easily and remove the magnet that way so at this point you just Carefully put the back plate back into position um, and put your screws back in, and there you go, that's it. Um, this very simple, easy, quick modification will reduce um, some of the magnetic interference that you get from the Sony Alpha 5100 camera. Thanks and bye bye.